Right, Storm, good to see you again. Uh, first home game of the season, 2-1 Liverpool in the end. Uh, they've come off the back of this Super Cup on Wednesday, but didn't show many signs of the fatigue that what uh, everyone was writing about. Uh, I think they may have made a bit much of that to try and throw the Saints players off, perhaps, because we seemed very lethargic at the start. Obviously, we, we in the first half, we did play a lot better than the than they did until the end of the first half where they got the goal. Start the second half, they came out all guns blazing. We kept it to 1-0 for a while. Then they got the tech, then they got a second after Valerie faffed with it in the corner. Ings, Dunepo and a couple of, other, a couple of other changes were made and suddenly we looked a lot more aggressive, a lot more expansive. I mean, for the, fir for the first half, other than their goal, we looked almost sort of the better side, but we just couldn't put our chances away story of our last season wasn't it We're not putting our chances away seems like business as usual but uh, no yeah we didn't put our chances away I personally think there should have been a penalty in that first half but I think it was Redmond got uh, got into the box then someone went through the back of him nothing happened where was VAR VAA wall yeah it seems like VAA wall yeah I like that one um, it seems like the referee was reluctant to review he was reluctant to pull his cards out until it was a Saints player but um, no, yeah, he did seem very reluctant to use the video review system. Whether or not the video review didn't see anything, just didn't see anything with the however many angles they've got, or if they where was VAR? Yes, yes, that's what I'm saying now. Uh, if, unless they just didn't see anything, in which case how they've got so many angles, or Mariner decided to ignore them. Either way around, it did feel a bit like oh, it's the referee again, big six bias. I said that last year. I was hoping this year I wouldn't have to say it because oh, we've got VAR, that should help. But where was that for the challenge Mane, Mane made on Gineppo, which pretty obviously should have been a red in my opinion, because well, he's gone in the height. He, it was, it was dangerous, you know, he's come through the back of him. Gineppo's actually come on, made his debut in the Premier League and looked quite lively. We're hoping that it is Mane Mark II, right? I think we are. Obviously, we don't want Mane Mark II and him going to Liverpool and then founding a Saints player and not getting sent off for it. But I think if he is Mane Mark II, that's a good, th that's a good sign of things. Because now we need is Pella Mark II and Tadic Mark II. <laughs> okay, so obviously the result, not what we wanted, but we were close to, but Brighton next weekend. Uh, we've, we've now started the season with two defeats. Yeah, well, we've, we've had many sections of two defeats or more, so as long as we're still picking up points somewhere, where that's going to be, I don't know. If we're lucky, it's against Brighton next week and possibly against United the week after, but... Let's just hope we get some points next week. Maybe maybe start the same way we finished the half, because that seemed to work very well.